Zero FXB, just a quick chat and a big thumbs up from me for the ICOM 705 microphone, the HM243. Now, I know many people have said they don't really like this microphone, but I, I don't get it. It's, it's, well, it's, the audio reports are excellent. The actual size of the microphone is, they say it's a bit small, but it's not actually um, much smaller than the um, 7300. Yeah, it's a bit narrower. It's actually, when I feel the weight of it, I mean, it's hard to say actually, but well, the 7300 has an up and down button on it, but the, the 705 microphone, which doubles up as a, a speaker microphone, also is completely programmable, and I'll show you how. So if you go into the menu here on the um, 705, let's just go menu, and go to set, then function, then scroll down to remote mic key. Now you can program the up and down arrows there, or the A and B button. Oops, sorry about that. Okay, so it's the up and down and the A and B that are completely programmable. So I'll just show you some of the settings. Uh, so let's go on the up and down, let's just click that and then we'll just scroll. So you've got home channel, VFO, volume up and down, DR mode, band group, RF power mode. You can change all these settings and the, the, the excellent thing is you can also do it with each A and B button and it's the same ones and there's several settings. How, can't, how can that not be excellent? The other thing about it is, at the moment, for example, if we turn up the uh, volume, get there in the end. Right, so there's the volume. So at the moment, what you're hearing, Wait for him to speak. Right, because I can Yes, um, I plan on getting out and about soon, uh, as I've um, start, well, just about to start a new job, so I will probably get so now, a new van. And watch me turn it down using and, the microphone. Uh, now watch uh, the volume on the radio. On the roof, and then I should be able to see what other repeaters I can pick up or simplex and we'll be able to. Hang on a minute. Looks like I must have changed the setting to, uh, from, I did have it on volume. So uh, let's just do that. So A, let's set it to volume down. So we'll go um, menu, set. Then we'll go function, remote mic. We'll go to A and we'll move it to volume down. There you go, we'll set it. Okay, we'll come out of that. Now let's see if we can get these... Right, there's them back talking. So watch what happens. So we'll go A. See that? See here? The volume is going down. So like I said, it's completely programmable. So then if I want, I can um, I can unplug the on the side here. I can unplug the jack, the top jack, which is the 3.5 mil jack. Okay, unplugged. So now turn it back round. Turn up the volume. Um, uh, I like 23 centimeters a lot. Um, that's a lot of fun. Um, and it's interesting playing. And of course, the microphone is still works, and it's got a very nice PTT on it, this one, and a very nice belt clip. That belt clip is just excellent and very strong. Very strong belt clip. I could even put it here, look. There you go. Sits there nicely. That's not going to fall out your pocket, that one. I think it's very strong. And now, I think the fact that it's got two, um, two jacks in the side is a good thing. Because it just makes it easier for, in, for you know, you can put cables in and experiment with your you know, your microphone and input and output um, and do all sorts with it. So M0FXB, I'm going to say a big thumbs up 
for the HM243 microphone that's on the 705. If anything, I'd like one for my uh, 7300 that I've got because I just think they're better. Um, but I'm not saying that the... Is it the 219? Is a bad mic. Very good reports um, from everyone. Um, but this one is way more fun. 7.3, all the best. Bye for now.